Oh, no, go ahead. Is your mic off? You did. I'll just get you passing by. <laughs> Okay, now turn it I think they're shooting, uh, setting up for a TV shot or something. I just have to wait for my headphones. Clean it open because I want to put the device and stuff. Alright, this is where we always start out right here in front of the shed horn. And, uh, these kids are selling uh, their bake bakery items and stuff like that to raise money. This is the stuff I have to stay away from. These ladies are uh, serving elk chiladas. There's sour cream there too. If you want to go there. there it is right there. Oh, that was good. And that, that had a little bite to it at the end. Oh, my God. That is so good. Ain't that good, Todd? Isn't that good? These are my neighbors. They have to live next to me. Yeah, we have to. That's Dave, the husband. <laughs> yeah, I can smell this right now. It smells so good. Uh, <laughs> what is this? Mexican elk meatball. Elk meatball. Just give me one. Yeah, that'd be great. You want cheese? Yeah. That looks good. Oh. This is, we were in the ball. <laughs> number 18. Number 18. Yeah. Mm. No, that's good, isn't it? That's good. There you go. It's good. All the way up from New Orleans. Alligator and shrimp. Wow, I can smell that. Woo! New Orleans, one word. New Orleans. New Orleans. Alligator, shrimp, fettuccine. I, I didn't have it on. <laughs> this is a saucy Asian-inspired elk meatball that came right out of the gravelly range right behind Wow. Me. You can try this right here. It's yeah, very delicious. It's too fast. Made with water. Here are some samples yeah, there. Let me give you some more sauce here. Can I make it? Oh, yeah. Very good. I knew that. I knew that. I said, huh? Hi. Hello. I know, huh? You got this one. So, what do you got this year? White tail chili verde. <laughs> Did you have that two years ago? Yes. We had most of the time it's elk. Surprise <laughs> winner here now. When I don't make it, people Just complain. So yeah, so we decided we better not have. Well, when you got something good, why change it? That's right. Thank you. So we did it again. Thank you. You ought to go down there and try that alligator shrimp. Is that good? Thank you. Oh. We never get high. Oh, that's okay. Oh. That's okay. There's that. So this is elk. White tail. Chili Verde? White tail. Oh, white tail, dear. We yeah. do it with elk, but this year we did it in white tail. White tail. And it is Look so at that. Good. Ain't that pretty? So far. Can I get a spoon? <laughs> uh, no, don't give me white tail Chili Verde. Well, hello. He's sitting in here right across from the Chili Verde. Wondering when do I get mine. So, all right, elk burger and beans? Yep. Wow. Thank you. You're very welcome. This is my favorite so far, right here. <laughs> Yay! That's what it looks like. Now I'm going to eat a little bit of that. All right. Yeah. What was this? Chili? Chili and uh, ten different kinds of beans. Yeah, but what kind of meat? Uh, I think they said it was woodchuck. <laughs> was this woodchuck? <laughs> Get them on there. This is good. Oh, yeah. So it is mm. woodchuck. Yeah. Oh. yeah. David Lemon having some woodchuck in downtown That's Annis, Montana. Uh, yep. I need help. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh. 
Now, what have you got here? Elk ragu. Elk ragu. Elk ragu. This. <laughs> we'll see what it tastes like. For a while. I brought my own spoon. Oh, okay. <laughs> They're green voting papers. Oh. And, uh... That's good, isn't it? At least it ain't chilly. What's that? I, the Hunter's Feet, this is a nice day for it. Oh, beautiful. I mean, usually it's cold and windy. Oh, no. Boy, this is the nicest Hunter's Feet weather you could have. I know, oh, it's perfect. perfect. God. Took it by a log splitter one of these days. <laughs> All right, there's the sign that says what it is. And I'm going to try it out. Hello there. Hi. Hi. Well, I had a spoon. <laughs> Must have fallen out of my Just hand. Come over there. We've got well, I'm trying to here. save you guys spoons. There you go. Hi. See you later. Alligator. Well, uh, no, no, elk. Elkalator. 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 This is a sculpture by Jim Dolan. It's been here since I moved here back in the 80s. He, <laughs> look at that. Isn't that a great picture? <laughs> No, you should be in there with those. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Everybody comes out to the hunter's feed. <laughs> Bring the horns and everything. How's the food, bub? I see the dog behind him, behind her. So we're in Ennis, Montana at the Hunter's Feed and the goat decided to show up because he knew that this was all wild game and he'd be safe. Right? <laughs> Is that right? Well, I, I don't know what he's eating, but I'm sure it's not some of the stew. <laughs> I know. That's so funny. I know. How you doing? Huh? That is hysterical. How'd go, go? Okay, this is Tony Bowen's uh, chili that she makes with... Is it vodka or whiskey? It's Windex. It's Windex. With Windex. Looks like Jose. She serves this every year, and, and boy, she wins. Now, is this elk? Quit talking. It sounded like you already lost your voice. I know. <laughs> okay, who's is this now? Yours? Number two? Hey, Windex. Windex. <laughs> Tony, just so good, I want you to hold okay, that okay. one. I bring it on. I'll be right out. Nope. I gotta try this. I'm loaded with Windex. We did, we did about three takes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think you did that on purpose. Oh, oh, it's like a shot. Oh, that's good. A little chilly with your tequila? Yeah, really. Oh, that's good. One for the wheelchair. As good as ever, Dave. Thank you. Oh, I'm Has fork, will travel. Is that one of those Caribbean? What's slowing things down is we have Backroads Montana doing a uh, video shoot here at the Hunter's Feet. Bighorn bourbon and hot apple cider. Lily's Bighorn bur uh, bourbon and hot apple cider. Hot apple cider. Willie's distillery is about a stone throw. Yeah, I know where it is. It's where that truck tipped over. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Would you like to try it? There it is. Oh, that's good. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, that warms it up to the inside. Uh, yeah, I can have a couple chefs that go for that. I can have a restaurant here and there. More private. What are you at? You got a ballot? We're number 27 on the ballot. What is it? What is it? Moose Sloppy Joe. Moose Sloppy Joe. And homegrown veggies from Fresh Frank, local private chef here. Okay. Down at the end. Mr. Joe's.
Joe Snyder shot the moose, the local moose. There you are. There we go. Enjoy. Pickled onions. Look at that. Jalapeno, Look at that. Thank you. All right, I'm having a little, uh, I can't remember what he called it, but some kind of apple cider and bourbon. Looks and sounds and tastes really good. Oh, bogs up the glasses. It's so hot. And then this is the, uh, I don't know what the hell meat this is. Did you hear what kind of meat this was? Oh, this is moose. Mm. If you haven't had a particular type of game, you'll get it here. Everything you can think of, they got. Uh huh. Even had alligator and shrimp, shrimp. mixed. <laughs> In Montana, of all places. Now, what are we serving here? We are serving chili elk and antelope Santa Fe chili. Wow. And it's the best. It looks good. So you best take a picture of that. I am. Okay. There you go. <laughs> That's what it looks like, guys. All right, I'm going to try this out. Yeah. No. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. That is very good. Number three, then. Vote number three. That's really good. What do we got here? This is venison fudge. It's what? Venison fudge. As opposed to elk fudge, like we had before. I can't eat it, but it looks, smells good. Well, it tastes the same as it did last time because yeah. it's the same recipe other than the meat. Yeah. You can't taste the meat. So, how do you make venison fudge? You use your favorite venison recipe, or no, your favorite fudge recipe. You cook brown venison, and you grind it in a blender so it's really fine, and I add a cup to each batch. If you want it more chewy, you can add some. Wow. That's imaginative. It, it was. It was from, the idea came from the Montana cattle women. They make beef fudge. You want some fudge? It's an elk whiskey chili. There's a lot of whiskey in it. They're serving elk whiskey chili. Yep. <laughs> now brace yourself on that cane because that's elk whiskey. <laughs> oh boy, I need this to hold me up then. <laughs> that's why I brought it. Okay, now this is funky. Funky pheasant chili. <laughs> oh God. Yep, we live in Ennis. <laughs> now you'll remember it, right? Are you guys good? Like a little pheasant chili. Oh what? All righty. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, that's good. Like that? Yeah. Number nine. All right. There you go, sir. Right? We've got venison taco. Crispy fried Ooh. tacos. You can't beat that. Anything that's fried, right? You're going to have to get one of these. All right. What are you serving here? An elk cheese bomb. Elk cheese bomb? Yes, sir. Wow. I got one. And I'll be trying that one out. Mm. Oh, good flavor. Town of Venice, to you. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, 2015 Hunter's Elk Feast. Beautiful weather, probably in the 50s or 60s. Just perfect weather. All right, good night, everybody. See you next year.